That's better. Turn the microphone on. Hey, it's Christmas Eve. This is 7 Minutes in the Morning, where five days a week you get tips and hacks dedicated to helping business owners and leaders just like you find and break through the one thing that is preventing your success. And now, here's the host of 7 Minutes in the Morning and your results coach, Tom Rigsby. Well, hey there. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to a uh, crisp. I like using the word crisp when it's cold outside. Hey, Jessica. Good morning. Merry Christmas Eve to you as well. Thank you so much for joining me. My name is Tom Rigsby. This is 7 Minutes in the Morning, the show where we talk about how to start, grow, and enjoy the benefits. That's what we're going to talk about today. Enjoy the benefits business ownership. Before we get into that, if you would do me a favor, when you get here, whether you're watching live or on the replay, do what Jessica has done already. Leave me a comment, say hi, say good morning, say whatever floats your boat. Uh, just to let me know that you are here. And if you get any value, but only if you get value from the show, give me the old thumbs up, like, um, hearts, whatever's appropriate in the venue where you, <clears throat> where you are watching. Well, I tell you what, clearly I've not had enough coffee yet this morning. So it is Christmas Eve. That means tomorrow is Christmas. A lot of you have already, uh, are already beginning your Christmas break and that is fantastic. So whether it's tonight, whether it's tomorrow, whether it's both or extended out over the whole week, here's what I want to, um, to bring to you. You know, I, I start the show by saying, you know, we're here to start growing and enjoy the benefits. And one of the great benefits is being able to control your schedule. Now, you do have to be responsive to your customer base. I understand that. But in the end, at the end of the day, we are relational beings. Human beings build relationships with other people. And it's terrible to say that any one day is the best day for doing that. You should be doing that every day of the year. But for most of us, Christmas is one of those times where we get to remember, I don't know, maybe bits out of our childhood, maybe bits out of great Christmases, but remember the reason why we worked so hard the rest of the year. At least that's the way that it works for me. If that's the way it works for you, I'd love to hear your thoughts about that in the comments also. But but it's it's one of those times where we get to celebrate the work that we do. And you guys know, I mean, I'm a big advocate of celebrating. If we don't celebrate our wins, then our, our brain doesn't really do its job to help us recreate those. So this is a great time of year to think about you know, and I, oh, it's so hard for me to, to turn off, you know, turn off thinking about the business. But I shift that. I do my best to try and shift that into thinking about the reasons why, right? You know, we talk about the benefits of, of having a business. What is the benefit? Well, the benefit is I get to, uh, I get to control my time. I get to control my schedule, my location. I get to be with the people I want to be with. And have some remembrance. Now, a lot of you know, tough year for me this year. You know, my son passed away this year. This will be the first Christmas without him. Yesterday was a particularly tough day for me, but, but all of that said, and, and for me and for my youngest daughters, we were talking about this a lot yesterday. Even in those circumstances, this is a great opportunity to remember positive things and good things and the reason why things happen. Not always easy to understand those things, but this is a great time. And the reason it's a great time is because not everybody, we've run into a couple of people shopping that weren't really in the Christmas spirit, but most people have a more open and joyful attitude right now, right? So, and, and it's, it's a pause. We get a couple of days off. It's a, just a good time to pause, pour into those important relationships and, um, 
and kind of reap some of the, the rewards of the hard work all year. Now, to that end, uh, my wife and I are going to be heading out to uh, Houston. We're going to spend some time with the oldest daughter as she is about to give us a great Christmas present of a new grandson. So by, let's see, today's Monday. So by this time on Thursday, we should have a new grandson, if not sooner. So so what I'm going to do the rest of the week, just to give everybody kind of, uh, kind of an idea, I'm going to record some messages to share uh, during the rest of the week. I may or may not be around. So I'm going to take some of my own, as I like to say, eat some of my own dog food here. I'm going to take some time and spend in those important relationships the rest of the week. But I I feel bad because you guys are an important relationship for me also. So my, I'm going to, I'm going to keep giving a little bit uh, throughout the week. I'll do my best to be in, uh, in the comments each morning. I think I'm going to record most of those videos today share those with you out uh, through the rest of the week. (coughs) Oh, thanks, Jessica. I appreciate that. And I'm, I'm with you. In fact, we actually start, uh, it's kind of blocked out on my calendar. I start the weekend after Thanksgiving, reflecting over the past year and planning for the next year. So yeah, most of December is a planning month for me. Um, do manage to pick up new clients, you know, and get a little bit of work done, but, but really, you know, December becomes that planning month, um, a way to look back at what we've accomplished and a way to look forward or a time to look forward at what we have to come. All right. Well, that's it for today. You guys have a fantastic day today, a, a great Christmas Eve, a great Christmas day tomorrow. I'll be talking to you throughout the week. And depending on how our schedule goes, we should be back here Monday, next Monday, with another installment of 7 Minutes in the Morning. Until then... You guys have a great, uh, great day and a Merry Christmas.